Hi, I'm Katie Wilhelm, a 15-year-old Ventura County teen. This past year, I've been volunteering with this great program called Straight Up. Straight Up engages teens and young adults in projects to reduce underage and binge drinking and impaired driving. Through Straight Up, young people can use their talents and passions to really make a difference in their communities. I like making videos, and so I took my video camera to a Straight Up reality party for adults and made a video about it because I wanted to show people the powerful events that went on there. The goal of Straight Up Reality Parties is to help parents be more aware and really understand the current culture of teen drinking parties and the very real pressures that young people face socially. We want to help parents have more relevant and meaningful discussion with their teens about the issues of underage and binge drinking and impaired driving. Reality parties take place in a home where parents take a 30 minute tour through a mock teen drinking party. They see what local teens have said are normal party activities and hear their attitudes and concerns about the social trends. To make this change possible, several teens give up their Saturday to participate in acting out a realistic drinking party for adults. So after arriving at 11 a.m., the fun begins and the volunteers gather around and choose the roles they want to play in the party. <laughs> Alright, right, so the other thing that I need is the access scene. Um, it's just there there's some of the longer, like heavier line. Um, that's the access to alcohol. I need like three or four people to do that. There is a script involved in the reality party. We need you to help change the perceptions, attitudes, and behaviors of adults. But there's also a lot of improvisation involved, and those are the two things combined to make the scenes in the reality party realistic. Just a few months after I brought my camera to the house tour, there was a reality party for parents' stage version performed at my high school. We've been doing these reality party house tours very successfully, but we can only get maybe 100 to 150 parents in for a night. And so we wanted to create a version of this that we could bring to parents, so we can do it at meetings where parents are already going to be, or we can do it in a theater such as this here at Newbury Park High School, where we can have a lot of people see it the same night. Another reason teens participate in Straight Up, though, is because it's fun. They hang out and meet new people, they have fun when they aren't rehearsing, and they even have fun when they are rehearsing. And of course, when it comes time to be serious, they do that too. Okay. You gotta go, so you gotta do this. you gotta just be like, so instead of chasing them off, you're like, no, you're too drunk to drive. Ugh. And then... Fine, you can find your own ride home. Where are my keys? Nothing was happening. I saw it. It's we were, over. We were just talking. No. Just talking? Don't. Yeah, don't. Don't like, touch me. Hey, man, what's your problem? You can't do like that. I can do whatever oh. I want. Oh. I'm out of here. Br Brandon, you're too drunk to drive. Whatever. There's also a lot of um, decisions that are being made that are regretted later on by a lot of the teams. And to be able to see this firsthand, they may have some idea that some of this stuff goes on, but they're always going to think, oh, but that's not happening with my kid or with their friends. Well, and that's what my daughter's, I mean, it just happened recently, because she's all of a sudden getting invited to places, and I said, well, I need to know where the house is and who are the parents, and are they going to be there? Mom, you know, I'm not going to, you know, I'm the, I'm the leadership kid, I'm not going to do that. And, well, I need to know, but that, it is weird, it's looked at as weird, because <laughs> none of my other parents' friends are asking about it. They're not. Well, my mom, she kind of, she, well, she knows that I party, but she doesn't care because I get good grades in school and I'm in the leadership class. <laughs> no matter what the reason they participate, though, teens will always have the ability to have a strong impact on the people around them. And that's why Straight Up is such an effective program. What adult wants to watch people throw away their lives at such an early age by going to a party they could have been prevented from going to or that could have been prevented from happening.
There are some things in the party that you just go, I never expected that. You know, like the older man with the camera who found out about it from somebody who thinks he's another kid. That, uh, that just sends tingles down my spine to see that. The whole room where we heard about the connection between sex and alcohol was um, just frightening, really, really frightening. And it was frightening not only because there was so much um, sex happening because of the drinking, but also because the kids were just lost. I don't think what I'm doing is good, but all the guys expect it, and maybe the girls expect it. I don't remember. I said no. A lot of the parents, I think, are kind of taken aback or shocked by just how much, by just how out of control the parties can get. I was completely shocked and it just really hurts to see kids hurting themselves that way. The amount that kids drink and the age that they start is so different from what I remember it to be. Um, you know, just the fact that, that it's nothing unusual to um, sit down and have 20 drinks in a sitting and to get as drunk as possible. You know, the goal is drinking to obliteration, which is a very different mindset than when I was young. Um, and that really shocked me, and I'm amazed at, at how young it starts as well. We've all gone through high school and all been to parties, and, and I think it was just a, a good reminder of situations, peer pressure, that as we grow up, we kind of forget about. Well, it was really powerful to be uh, right there in the room, kind of like the, the fly in the wall sort of thing, watching what happens at parties. Uh, you know, it helped me to understand the social environments that our kids are experiencing and the real dangers associated with that kind of thing. Um, I don't think a lot of parents realize what their kids are exposed to, even if they're good kids, great kids, you know, that sort of thing. Um, it was really a really kind of a powerful deal. It was also very helpful to sit down after the fact and talk about it, kick it around, and maybe chat about things that we can do. and exchange ideas, how we can keep ourselves more aware of what's going on and how we can keep our kids safe. I was shocked the other day when my daughter told me she had 300 phone numbers on her cell phone. I thought, I don't even know 300 of her friends. And the scary thing about that is with one click, she can communicate with all of them at one time. So I plan on going home and talking to her about who these numbers belong to and maybe seeing if we can delete some of them. I would love to tell many people about it and I think every parent should go through it. You know it was surprising to hear that there are parents who are actually allowing these things to go on in their homes. I mean they think if they take the keys away from kids they can justify it and uh, letting them drink or do whatever right there in their own house. I mean I don't get that. I think that we need to start applying some serious adult peer pressure and mean it in order to let people know that we won't accept that in the community. That's the bottom line. Everyone's safe because I have their car keys. So as long as they're under my roof drinking, they're safe. Stop. Stop accepting underage drinking as a rite of passage. Stop providing alcohol to youth, either knowingly or ignorantly. Parents, stop hosting teen drinking parties or allowing them to happen while you're away. Stop letting other adults host teen drinking parties. Parents. So from rehearsals... Fine, you can find your own keys! <laughs> the actual tours. Straight Up is a great program for teens and parents. It shows how dangerous underage and binge drinking is and what we can do to prevent it. All we have to do is our part to make, make it stop. stop. Thanks for watching. This is Katie Wilhelm, Straight Up. Straight Up is made possible through funding from the Ventura County Behavioral Health Department Prevention Services.